How's it everybody, Celtic Link here and we're back for another Dokkan Battle video. In today's video we are wrapping up our series on the ultimate life form versus the Gods of Destruction. Today we are taking on the Universe 8 God of Destruction, Lacor. And boy do we have a bad setup here. So we're going to go ahead and activate the Android's active skill and kind of protect us for I this turn. I think it's time to put him out of his misery, 17. Why are you in such a rush? Let's just try to enjoy ourselves. If we wipe out all of humanity now, then the fun ends and we've got nothing left to do, right? Alright, very nice. Yeah, we definitely needed to do that, if only because... Orbs just did not fall in our favor, and even now they're not, so... That risky one orb pickup there didn't really work. I was hoping the uh, tech orbs would have fallen the way they fell just now for the, uh, after the third uh, pickup. So, two key spheres is all we managed to pick up with these guys. So they're not going to be looking as good. And Cell, of course, did not proc an additional. 2.2 million, though, on them is not bad, considering we only did pick up two key spheres. The androids aren't doing that much damage, but they do launch an additional. So every little bit of damage helps here, because most of our allies here are at type disadvantage. And we get the third. Very nice. So, with that, um, we're going to roll into the next turn, and I'm going to do the smart thing and put Jero in 19 at front, because I have a sneaking suspicion there is a super attack there, so we're going to play it safe. It's probably not the smartest play to put 18 in the third slot here, but I'm going to do it because I feel like if she can take enough damage, we can proc Int Cell's heal and get him to super perfect cell, which will make this run slightly easier. And there's that super attack I was worried about against the Jiro 19. So, only get 78k because, well, we got... We did get a defense raise beforehand. And our 79% cell goes ahead and does not additional. That's not good. Now, come on, 18 needs to come through with these additionals here. And she got a normal. I was singing her praises in quite a few of the last few videos. What's happening? <laughs> Where are those additionals? I, we, she needs those additionals for that, that extra defense to survive in this event. did not take enough damage to proc int cells revive. So what we're going to do is we're going to pop the androids in front and pick up the 13 key spheres for a nice big heal. We'll keep our cell in the middle and we will float off the int cell by picking up these int orbs here. So we'll get a nice pretty big heal back. Unfortunately, we weren't able to revive with the cell and transform into super perfect cell, but I'll, I'll take 13 key spheres with the androids any day. 3.4 million, nice. And the super attack is against the androids once again. Very nice. This just makes this all the more easier for us. That's the main reason they're here, is to absorb those super attacks. All right, nice. Our cell does proc his additional. That's good. Oh, we got the dodge. That sucks. Okay, that would have been some nice extra damage there. All right, so gonna go ahead and transform into second form cell with our cell, and hopefully we can uh, park a few additionals, get some attack raises before we transform, because there's nothing more infuriating than having perfect cell without his nice, pretty attack stat. All right, so I think what we'll do is we'll have. Cell pick up this one, and then the AGL androids pick up the two so they can get their 18 key. Oh, he's got to stop dodging. This is actually not fair. But at least the super attack was once again against Shiroa 19, so no damage. Yay. Alright, so 4.8 on the Cell. No crit, but we do get the additional and we're up to 5.1. Very nice. 3.5 on the crit, and we proc the third for 
three. Can we get a crit on the third? We do, 3.7, nice. So we got a good chunk of damage off on him. Now, as long as the AGL androids proc a few of their additionals, they won't take too much damage, even though they are at tight disadvantage. Awesome. Alright, so Friend Cell is going to go ahead and transform into Perfect Cell. Um, unfortunately, this friend was 55%. Now that the hype has died for, down for Cell, I can't find anybody running him aside from a few 55%ers. Alright, so we're going to... Ooh, we got 14 this turn. Alright, we're going to put the androids in front and pick up those 14. Um, we'll pick up the Fizz Key Spheres here with the friend Cell. So not a bad attack stat. That defense is worrying me though on him. So he definitely needs to make sure he additionals. Otherwise we're gonna have a problem. Ooh, seven million on the attack stat with the androids. And of course they dodged this be that beautiful attack. That's unfortunate. But once again, super attack is in the first slot against the androids, which means we are safe this turn. 5.1 million to start, not bad for 55% and gets the crit but no additionals all right so we're gonna rely on 18 here then please don't die on us all right excellent so our cell is gonna go ahead and transform to perfect cell um, I believe we will have int cell on this rotation so we'll get big bad bosses active and deal Quite a bit of extra damage here, so that'll be good for us. Question is, what is the smart play here? I guess it doesn't really matter where we put him, so we'll just put him in front here. Pick those up, and nice, the int keys here did fall the way we want them, so we're going to be able to get the 18 key with the perfect cell, and boom. So we'll rotate off Shiro 19 because I'm pretty confident we can finish this. No crit, but we do launch the initial 9.9 .9 million, almost 10 million on that attack set. That is beautiful. But of course he doesn't want to crit. <laughs> Alright, so just imagine if that wasn't type disadvantage, right? <sighs> Ooh, Int Cell is the one to take the hit this time. Well, 209. Look at that. 209k with us being type advantage. That is brutal. Alright, very nice. We get the two additionals with, or I'm sorry, two super attacks with Jiro and 19. So we're not taking, not that we were taking damage before, but we definitely ain't taking any now. All right, so got a bunch of key spheres that could line up perfectly, but we do have rage mode active. So we're going to go ahead and activate that and try to kill them off with this just to be safe. Losing. I'm actually losing. No. All right, we're going to go ahead and pick up these uh, AGL spheres here. We'll pick up the Ent ones here. And finish off with these last tech orbs. So once again, we've gotten all three super attacks with our rage mode. So the question is, can we finish them with the 55% cell? And he is down for the count with 1.8 million damage from the friend cell. So there you have it, folks. There is AGL Cell, the ultimate life form versus the gods of destruction. At this point, at this video, we have defeated every single god of destruction. No items with the AGL Cell team. And we've only had to swap in and out a few times, right? Whether it was swapping out our support cast with the AGL 13 or even with uh, the Fizz Cell. This has been the pretty much consistent team we've run it with, and we've run it pretty well. Like I said, I have found that the Androids and the Cells team is far superior to the Ginyu team, who basically only works if you're running Ginyu. So anyways, I, I hope this has proved to you guys why I believe Cell is probably one of the best TURs on Global at this current moment. 
And if you liked this video, why don't you go ahead and like the video. If you liked the series, go ahead and subscribe to the channel in the comments down below. Why don't you let me know uh, your thoughts and or feelings on Cell versus Ginyu. And with that, thanks for watching and aloha.